In this video, we see the second numerical problem based on composition of functions. We have already seen one numerical problem for the same. This is the succession of the previous video. This is the second video numerical problem composition of functions. Let us see what the question has to say to us. There is a function which is defined from real numbers to real numbers and the function value is x upon under root 1 plus x square. What do we need to find? We need to find f of f of x. Do you understand this? Earlier we had f of g of x or g of f of x. Here we do not have two functions. We have only one function fx and we have nesting among these functions only. Let us see what the problem has to say. fx is given to me as x upon under root 1 plus x square. Actually f of f of x means what? It means that we have to write down in this manner. Firstly we have this f which is to be ignored for now. Then we have f of x. Now what is the value of f of x? f of x has got the value from the question itself and from the step itself. So the outer f of the function stays as it is and f of x the internal one obtains the value. So what is the value? That is x upon under root 1 plus x square. Now this x upon under root 1 plus x square is not the solution. We have to move further on f of this whole bracket. Now f of x means function and in it we have a variable. f of this bracket means the whole bracket will now serve as my x. So it becomes f of x. Now what do we mean by f of x? That means wherever we have single variable x, we need to substitute it by this value x upon under root 1 plus x square. So the numerator now becomes what? That will be seen. We have x upon under root 1 plus x square and we need to solve it for this question. Now let us see. It becomes x upon under root 1 plus x square in the numerator and the denominator is a bit lengthy so we need some more space. Under root 1 plus x square we have under root 1 plus x square. What is x? x is the whole thing so we need to substitute it and it is the whole square so we need to write the whole square as well. Now what is left is we are left with only the simplification of the denominator rest all stories already done. So let us simplify the denominator the numerator does not need to be changed you do not need to change the numerator let it be kept as it is. We need to put a upon sign we need to put a point sign we already did. x square upon under root 1 plus x square was the story. So this under root 1 plus x square does not change we do not need to leave it. Now what we will be doing is. 1 plus what is x square? It is x square only. What is under root 1 plus x square square? It is only 1 plus x square. The outer root over should not be left. It should be there. So we just keep it as it is and do not merge the root over as I was supposed to do. Now only simplification is left, we need to just take the LCM, do the necessary stuff. Let us go there. x upon under root 1 plus x square, whole upon, we did the whole upon, things get changed to LCM. When we take the LCM, it should be 1 here. 1 plus x square goes up, it becomes 1 plus 2x square upon 1 plus x square with the root over separated on both the terms. What I did was there was one single root I did split into two roots. So it becomes two roots. Now you can see some things get cancelled. These things get cancelled. So what is the final answer? The final answer that we are left on with is x upon under root 1 plus 2x square. So the answer is x upon under root 1 plus 2x square. So in this video what did we do? We saw a question based on the composition of functions. 
This was the second video in the succession. In the next video, we will see the next question on composition of functions. Thank you.